a fish has a bladder in her body actually in fish is also one kind of bladder is there what they are doing whenever they are sucking the air from the water into these bladders whenever air is going to move inside their bladder means volume of the like uh, bladder you can say volume of the bladder is going to increase for example bladder is this much whenever they are going to fill it with the air bladder volume is going to increase and as we know density is equals to mass by volume if they are going to move in if the air is going to move inside the like a uh, bladder of the fish means volume of the bladder is increases volume increases means density is going to decrease if density decreases in that case fish can float on sea water but if i am saying the other side that why fish are going to sink in a sea water sinking means whenever whatever air is filled in her bladder that air it push out to move in the water when the air moves out means volume is going to reduce if volume reduces we know density is equals to mass by volume if volume reduces means density is going to increase so whenever density increase it can easily sink in a sea water so it is all depend upon the bladder whenever it is going to fill it with the air the volume increases density decreases and whenever it is going to empty it from the air means here volume decreases and density increases so like this way fish can easily float or sink in a water so when it forces the air out when the fish is going to force the air out from the bladder its average density is going to more and it can sink in a water why it is more as i already told if vol if air is going to move outside volume is going to reduce volume reduce means density is going to more if density is more of an object as compared to water it will sink in a water